Oh, 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 TV. They scared, but I'm not. They don't like comentario. Y suscribe. All you guys, like, oh, remember last year, same group of people on ESPN couldn't believe arguing because they had, hey, be hey, girl, Becky Hammond, we ain't forget Hammond. about you. New we ain't forget about you. It's no surprise that the New York Liberty about to spank up on her and send her home. The Good. New York Liberty. You all mad over there, Kelsey. I'm not getting too too excited about what's going on, Kelsey. Shorty, that's something that was arguing with Spike. Oh, Kelsey Plum. Yeah. I, I don't mean to. I'm sorry, Kelsey. I don't mean to get, yell at you like that. All right, baby. Hold. On. My uh, girl, I my girl, Vanda Sloot is busting her behind right now, killing Damn. her. Damn. That's that's your girl fault, Becky. Go tell Becky. Yo, why are you playing with New York like that, man? That little short guy. He's a one A. We played them in the finals last year, and the Aces beat us in the finals last year. We got the Aces in the second round. Brianna Stewart had 34 last night, spanking up on them. Get Becky out of here. Go ahead. Real, real quick, MVP, the most dominant player in all of basketball, any, any gender. MVP. Aja, Asia, excuse me, Aja? Or Asia? Whatever you feel like saying. I want to get it right. I don't like. Listen, there's one thing about me. I don't like getting people's names wrong. I don't like getting people's names wrong either. I believe it's Asia. Okay, Asia Wilson, MVP, most dominant player. How do you feel about her? Is it you know? It's just like shout the raw guy matchup problem. Yeah, I mean, something that stuck out to me last night was that John Quill Jones gives her problems. Like John Quill Jones is our big for the Liberty. And John Quill Jones ain't no slouch, right? She ain't no pushover. Asia Wilson don't go in there and kick her behind. Like, they battle. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm curious to see how she takes it up a, a, another level. I'm, I'm curious to see. But they've won back-to-back -back championships. They're, on a, they're trying to win three in a row right now. So okay. I got to see somebody beat them. And I, I got full faith in the Liberty because I like this Liberty team tough. They got, I got to see them beat the aces i gotta see them beat them you gotta knock the champ out yeah i gotta see it happen before i'm like asia can't do it because she's done it back to back years what a, what is the what is the aces not doing well last night what i saw was that they just couldn't hit shots chelsea gray had like two points she only took a couple shots last night um kelsey plum didn't shoot the greatest and asia just gotta assert her dominance when she dominates the game, can't nobody do nothing about the game. That who, who did you just mention right now that seems to be her kryptonite? John Quill Jones. She's giving her that much of a problem? Match, uh, match just a problem? defensively. It just looked like John Quill asked for the ball um, in the post yesterday, and they threw her a post-entry pass, and she shielded off Asia, got the, got, the, got the ball, went up strong, and she did get, Asia did block the shot. But my point is that I, Asia's just super athletic and can recover. You talk about a two-time defensive player of the year. Like, she pushed her off the block, went and got it. Pump fake was going to go up. That just gave Asia mad time to recover. She recovered and blocked the shot. But what I'm saying is, what I noticed was, is that she pushed Asia all the way off the block. So I'm like, okay, John Quell is just as strong as her. She just can't overpower her on the block, moving around and stuff like that. She just can't do what she wants with her. So that's why I said this series is going to be interesting because I want to see how she asserts her dominance on the Liberty like she did last year. Last year in the finals, they couldn't do nothing with her. Nothing. Hold on. So that's the other thing I was confused about. How are they in the semifinals and they win the finals last year? I don't. And I've been trying to figure that out myself. I don't know if they did a realignment of the teams on how they, how they align the teams, but they matched up in the finals, which is tough. Like, I like that. But now them seeing each other in, in the – the second round or first yeah second round uh, that's kind of weak i mean they got get the week up out of here because they're getting spanked because it from what, what the way y'all telling me she's getting they they a certain they dominance and they sound like they're in trouble this girl yelling at spike once you start talking to spike it's done for you and you ain't got no reggie miller in you oh yeah. liberty li liberty defensive scheme got asia off her square last night mm. same thing you saying yeah it's just I, I saw them pushing her around a little bit i ain't never seen nobody like We've seen people try to get physical with her, but it never affects her game. She always, you know, matches the physicality and is like, you're not as good as me. I'm going to bust your ass. But it's, So the first thing I think about when I think about a uh, 
I'm used to saying big man, but you know the bigs in the in the, in the game is anyone making the game easier for them? Like Kobe, uh, Asia, because if Kobe used to that them drop off, them cut to the drive to the baskets. Remember, everyone kept saying, uh, Shaq is getting two or three people on him. Kobe used to have two or three people on him too. Sometimes he used to mask it. He used to play that fake zone, the zone defense on him. He gets to the basket, dump the ball off to Shaq, make it easier for him. Is anybody not making it easier for Asia? Well, we got to remember. First half of the season, Chelsea Gray was out. So that's their point guard. So it was missing her for like an extensive period of time. She was injured. And so now she's just been back, I don't know, maybe the last month or two. So they kind of re ingratiated her into the lineup. And she's a hell of, you know, Chelsea Gray's a hell of a player, a hell of a point guard, right? A bigger guard. So I just think all year long, they've been up and down, right? Winning three in a row ain't easy. Now people have plenty of tape out there on you. People got plenty of game plans, plenty of schemes, right? So it's hard to do that three times in a row. <laughs> they was yeah. putting that, putting uh, that pain on. Right. They were putting that pain on. Yo, by, by the way, I like Wise, what up, man? I, I think you part of the um, what's what's that guy? Corey Lee and them over there, blonde, blonde boys. Okay. They was put big shout out. Seven one eight boys. They was putting that pain on Asia. Got to keep her down. She's tough. King Speech also updated us. They just do the top eight seeds now in the WNBA, the whole league now instead of East or West, regardless. Ah, okay. Appreciate you, King Speech. So that's why that's why the alignment didn't go. Huh. Wonder when uh <laughs> the NBA will do that. They're gonna have to because the West is from top to bottom is damn near everybody's good. Like you said, there's not a night off over there, damn near. And also they did it in college already. So, you know, once they start implementing stuff in other leagues, especially in America. You know, like even with, with soccer, well, you know, football, real football, they don't have. I don't think they have no rule like that unless you play your your club, your club league championships or whatever it is. It's only right. We want to see the best play the best at the end of the day, no matter where you at. And then now, remember the Lakers. Depending on who you know got who got the hot hand, you could have teams in a certain conference like like the, they don't want another Western Conference from twenty years ago. You don't want, or even from ten years, from fifteen years ago. Yo, listen, Ray. Like we just talked about, the Western Conference is a gauntlet right now. A gauntlet from one, what is it, split 15, 15, 15, right? So 15 teams in the Western Conference, aside from maybe Portland, everybody else, you got to put your big boy pants on and play. Everybody else. Now, let's get back to these Knicks. Let's get back to these Knicks. Excuse me. Knicks rehab. Last year, all I ever heard from Becky Hammond, that's what we brought her up. Hey, girl. And a bunch of other cowards. Wojanowski. See, Gil, we hated Woj because he was, he wasn't, he's over there siding with, 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 with Becky Hammond at the time. We hated his guts too because he's supposed to be CAA all day, siding with Becky Hammond's monkey ass, talking about we can't win a championship with Brunson. What? Now, all we're hearing is championship expectations. I thought we couldn't win a championship with the best star lineup in the league. I thought we would. Bobby Marks. I saw Bobby Marks say, on paper, we have the best starting lineup in basketball. Oh, <laughs> oh, ball TV. They scared, but I'm not. They don't like commentario. Isus Cribe. 